What's up YouTube, how y'all doing? My name is Beaker and welcome to my channel. On today's YouTube video, we're we'll looking at the Cold War AK. Now I know this gun, um, it's a little bit harder to use. Uh, I use this one as a sniper support personally, just because I don't like the double AR meta. So decided to run this thing. Uh, I never really gave it a shot. I've picked it up a few times from other people, um, but it's one of those guns that you can't really iron out. And huge, huge shout out. I know I'll never see this, but huge shout out to Iceman Isaac for doing the build that i am running in this video it's a complete laser beam like period like let alone for an ak this thing is super super easy to control the recoil is pretty much non-existent pretty far ranges i was able to beam people with this thing and it's it's pretty close to being my my go-to sniper support gun i still really do like the xm4 i think it has a really good place ffar is really good too i just don't like how fast that i burn through ammo on it this gun, because it shoots so slow, having 45 round mag or even a 60 round mag, you can wipe a full team no problem without reloading. It's insane how much this thing hits. But don't miss your shots. You'll pay heavily because of it because it shoots so slow. It makes it extremely unforgiving, which honestly I think is a very good balance. So I am going to have the build at the very end of the video. Again, not taking any credit. This is a 100% I spent Isaac's build. That's where I saw it. That's where I gave it the shot. But if you guys haven't seen the video, I'm just going to put the build at the end of mine. Uh, but be sure to check out his channel. He does a lot of testing on that stuff, and we definitely appreciate it here. If you guys liked today's YouTube video, it'd be much appreciated if you guys drop a like and also subscribe to the channel. If you guys want to watch me live on Twitch, I stream Monday through Friday from 7 to 11. I'm going to leave the link down in the description below so you guys go go ahead and check that out. If you guys want to jump in the chat, drop a follow. Whatever you guys want to do to show support, I greatly appreciate it. We'll see you guys out there. Peace. Equin. Oh, one guy right by you, Joey. Maybe in, right there. Maybe? Moving. Oh, two guys running, Joey. Got one. Is Bob back? Yeah. I'm gonna go watch this guy's shit. Enemy UAV, okay. There's two guys up there. Fuck! I John back, please. Someone just bought a loading to the right. I grabbed Ghost, yeah. Oh, yep. Oh, he just saw me. Maybe. I'm getting hit! Fuck, you got Kate being right here. This sucks. Right to my right. Fire. One in the blue. Uh. Another one coming up. Another one coming up. Good nice. shit. I had my fucking be right back screen this whole time. Fuck. I'm getting sucked up in somewhere. Oh, but that's not theirs. Uh, I'm on that, yeah. Oh shit, hey, full, full squad behind us. Uh, I can't mark right yeah. Moving. I'm bailing, bailing right. I downed one and then cracked the other one. Uh, UTB rolling right up to it. Uh, 
Are you kidding me? I missed. Down one though. Down him. No! Hey, guy here, guy here, guy here. I need recon on my position. UAV on you? The AO. Yep. Marking you safe zone. So the teammates across the way. It's going upstairs. Got him. RTB for resupply. He rezzed with his teammate. Throwing stun. Got one. Dude, satchels and shit in here. Yeah. They're like on the back stairs. Loadout drop inbound. Yeah, they. Second floor in the back. Oh my god, I see these guys sniping too. Fuck. Fuck, I don't even know where to go, man. Are you rushing this? I've got the stuns. I can I mean, stun him from here. I'm almost Ready? at this center stairwell. Yep. Go now, that. go now. Go. Oh. Kaden! What are you- Oh, he was not happy at his fucking teammate. <laughs> fucking Kaden! What are you doing? John, drive to the house. Victory rests on your side. Finish the mission. I got fucked. We wait. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. How is that? Sh oh my gosh. Enemy UAV overhead. You have one stand left too. Thanks. Is there a rocket launcher here? What? Maybe push out the right? Oh, yeah. yeah, I need this team to get fucking... Right, guy, jump, jump, guy jumped out to your right. Yep, yep, yep. Not even gonna shoot.
Hey. Thanks, Matt. So it was so close, man. I fucking had it. GG. Yeah, that was a Sorry, good game. Sorry, you'll get us next time. Yeah, it's kind of tough <laughs> yeah. to fight uphill for a fucking camping team that probably just did recons the whole game. But yeah, man, good game. Good game, uh, man. Bro, good game. All right, guys. So here was that AK build I was just using. Again, I take zero, 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 zero credit for figuring this out. All on Iceman Isaac. I love this thing. Again, it's right up there with the XM4 for me. Um, as far as like if I'm hitting my shots, this is definitely the gun to use. If I'm not doing so good, I'm going to use the XM4 because again, uh, it's a lot more forgiving because the fire faster. Fire, Jesus, faster fire rate. Dope. So, so on this one, we're going to go with just the regular suppressor because we need to increase our ADS time um, because it is an AR. So, ADS times is as good as like an SMG. We don't really need the range like the groove suppressor does for us because, again, it is an AR, has better range than like a standard um, submachine gun. So, we just use this one on there. The Microflex LED. So, this is part of that really good build. Having super, super clear vision with this gun is very, very helpful. We don't run a barrel because of that. I've done this in, in the past before, not running a barrel on like the FFAR and having a sight, uh, even though the iron sight is super clean. I was just kind of testing some stuff out. So that's one key part to this. Um, and then the other part is not having the barrel, not having that and being able to have a super clean sight with the Spetsnaz grip just again, makes a single laser beam. What was throwing me off before was people were using the RPK barrel, which increases vertical horizontal recoil. Um, and it's just it makes it uncontrollable for me. Um, and apparently I spent Isaac too, because this is what he uses. So again, I love this build. Uh, the skeletal stock is the very last stock. I was using the PKM for a while, but they're both pretty much the same. They both have really good mobility, but this one just ends up working a little bit better because it has the ADS firing movement speed. Buff is a little bit better than the skeletal, than the PKM stock. Um, as I said before, you can run the 45. Uh, it's definitely plenty, but if you really, really want to just annihilate a full squad without reloading, use a 60. So that's kind of my take on it. Thanks again for sticking around at the very end. I'm going to throw in again, huge shout out to Iceman Isaac. I really appreciate it. I love this thing. It's, again, one of my favorites. So give this thing a shot. We'll see you guys in the next one.